हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय सेल्फ प्रोफेसर राजेंद्र बाबूराव घारसे वर्किंग एज एन हेड ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट एट एन बी नवले सिंहगढ़ कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग सोलापुर आई एम हैविंग अ टीचिंग एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ नाइन इयर्स आई हैव कंप्लीटेड बी ई इलेक्ट्रिकल फ्रॉम गवर्नमेंट कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग कराड एंड एम टेक फ्रॉम इंडियन इंस्टिट्यूट ऑफ साइंस बेंगलोर I have qualified GATE examination six times, and in the achievements, I have secured all India seventh rank with a 99.96 percentile in the GATE examination. Okay, so in my last video, we have discussed about the behavior of R, L, and C elements with non-zero initial condition. Okay, today we are going to discuss some numericals from previous university. examinations okay so let us discuss the first one here it is the example okay asked for 8 marks in the exam december 2016 okay so <clears throat> for the network shown in figure with k open steady state is reached okay means which k is open for long time okay means which k is open from t is equal to Minus infinity. Okay. Next, at t is equal to zero, switch is closed. Means we are, we are going to close this switch at t is equal to zero. Okay. So find v a of zero minus v a of zero plus v b of zero minus and v b of zero plus. Okay. Find v a of zero minus v a of zero plus v b of zero minus and v b of zero plus. We need to find. Here it is a V B. Here it is a V A. Means we need to draw the equivalent circuit at zero minus as well as zero plus. Okay. So next. So this is the given circuit. Okay. Switch K is open for long time. Okay. Means suppose this switch K is open from T is equal to minus infinity. Okay. So in the circuit we are having the resistors and a capacitor. Okay. So, as we know, the resistor for all time t it behaves as a resistor only. Okay. Next, so switch is open from t is equal to minus infinity. Okay. So please check from t is equal to minus infinity or before t is equal to minus infinity. What is the voltage across the uh, capacitor? Yes, it is a zero volt because capacitor has not charged. Okay. Next. At t is equal to minus infinity, the capacitor will behave as a short circuit. Next, after t is equal to minus infinity, yes, is there any way to for the charging of the capacitor? Yes, even though the switch K is open, the current will flow from 5 volt voltage source through these two resistors and to the <coughs> capacitor. And second loop, we are having the this type of this one is the second loop, right? So here we are having the charging of the capacitor, which is Which have started from t is equal to minus infinity, right? So as time t is equal to from time t is equal to minus infinity, the capacitor goes on charging. So as time reaches zero minus, okay? As time reaches zero minus, what is the status of capacitor? The capacitor will act as an open circuit, right? Means capacitor has charged fully, so capacitor will act as an Open circuit. Are you getting the point, right? So, at t is equal to zero minus, can we draw the equivalent circuit? Yes, this is the equivalent circuit at t is equal to zero minus. Capacitor is acting as an open circuit. Voltage V A is V A of zero minus. V B is V B of zero minus. Are you getting the point, right? So here for this circuit, okay. So here we are having the current is coming out from the positive plate, but whether the closed path is available for the incoming current at the negative plate. No, right? This is the open circuit, right? So current will not flow in this circuit. Are you getting the point, right? So current in all the branches will be zero, right? So if we apply KVL to this loop, right? Can we say that yes, VC of zero minus is equal to five volt. Yes, it is plus five minus ten into zero minus twenty into zero minus VC of zero minus. So what is the VC of zero minus? VC of zero minus is equal to Same as that of the supply voltage, that is a five volt. Okay, so if we consider it as a zero volt, here it is a zero volt. V C of zero minus is also five volt, right? So what is the V B of zero minus? Negative plate potential is zero volt. So what is the positive plate potential? Definitely, it should be a five volt, right? So if V B of zero minus is five volt, what about the V A of zero minus? Current in the circuit is zero. So what is the potential difference across twenty ohm resistor? 
it will be zero i into 20 right current is zero so it is a zero into 20 so it is a zero volt right so vb of zero minus will be same as that of the v of zero minus right so can we say that v of zero minus is equal to vb of zero minus is equal to 5 volt and what is the vc of zero minus it is also 5 volt right next at time t is equal to zero or t is equal to zero plus right means now the switch we are going to close the switch okay so the switching instant is nothing but t is equal to zero okay so before t is equal to zero the whether the capacitor has charged yes the capacitor has charged to the voltage of 5 volt means it is like a non-zero initial condition are you getting the point right so for t is equal to zero or zero plus okay the capacitor will behave as an voltage source capacitor will behave as an voltage source okay this voltage is va of 0 plus vb of 0 plus okay now for this circuit in order to find the v of 0 plus and vb of 0 plus can we apply the nodal analysis yes apply ksl at the v of 0 plus here it is 0 volt 0 volt here it is 0 volt so this is the 5 volt right if this is 0 volt here it is a 5 volt so what is the vb of 0 plus it is a 5 volt right vb of 0 plus is 5 volt next apply KCL apply KCL right so KCL equation we are having it is a 5 minus V of 0 plus by 10 is equal to V of 0 plus minus sorry V of 0 plus by 10 plus V of 0 plus minus V of 0 plus by 20 but V of 0 plus is 5 so it is V of 0 plus minus 5 by 20 okay after simplifying we can get the value of V of 0 plus and it is equal to 1 volt this is equal to 1 volt right are you getting the point next let us discuss the second example okay asked for 4 marks in the exam may 2017 okay find current through 5 henry inductor current through 5 henry inductor at t is equal to 200 millisecond they ask the question uh, sorry ask the current in the inductor at t is equal to 200 millisecond means here we need to derive the expression for current flowing through the inductor for t greater than 0 right and once we get the expression of that current and then we can replace that time t in that current expression with a 200 millisecond and we can get the current value okay so here from the circuit it is clear that the switch is opened at t is equal to 0 right switch is opened at t is equal to 0 means initially the switch is closed means initially the switch is closed are you getting the point right so t is equal to minus infinity the switch is closed t is equal to minus infinity the switch is closed right switch is closed at t is equal to minus infinity so from minus infinity current will be flowing like this this is the one current and this is the second current so at minus infinity what is the inductor at minus infinity inductor will act as an open circuit at zero minus inductor will act as an short circuit at zero minus the inductor will act as an short circuit okay so can we find i of zero minus yes it is 24 by 10 that is a 2.5 right because potential difference between these two points is equal to 24 so is equal to 24 by 10 that is a current so current is i of zero minus is equal to 2.4 ampere right next at t is equal to 0 what will happen yes inductor will act as an current source of 2.4 ampere right so we are having the circuit for t is equal to 0 it is like switch is open now right switch is open switch open means what this excitation is not connected to the circuit okay so in the circuit we are having only 40 ohm 10 ohm and this is the inductor but at t is equal to 0 that inductor is acting as an current source right so we are having the t is equal to 0 the equivalent circuit is like this okay so what is i of 0 i of 0 is also 2.4 ampere for t greater than 0 yes we can yes inductor will act as an inductor okay so for this circuit can we apply kvl yes it is minus 10 into i of t minus 5 into di of t by dt minus 40 into i of t is equal to 0 okay so further we can rearrange the terms right and can we yes find the solution of this equation yes we need to find the integrating factor so integrating factor is equal to yes e to the power integration of 10 dt so it is e to the power 10 t right next solution of the differential equation right i of t into e to the power 10 t is equal to integration of 0 integrating factor due to plus c from this initial condition same steps we are repeating right <coughs> from the initial condition we can find i of 0 right so once we get i of 0 we can put that no, sorry once get c value we can put it in equation 1 and we can find the i of t right now this is the generalized expression for i of t for t greater than 0 okay 
सो बट आवर टास्क इज टू फाइंड द करंट आई ऑफ टी एट टी इज इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड मिली सेकंड सो कैन वी रिप्लेस दिस टी विथ टू हंड्रेड मिली यस सो इट इज रिप्लेस्ड विथ टू हंड्रेड मिली टू हंड्रेड मिली मीन्स पॉइंट टू सेकंड ओके सो आफ्टर रिप्लेसिंग इट वी कैन गेट आई ऑफ टी इज पॉइंट थ्री टू फोर एट एम पी एर ओके सो दिस इज अबाउट द सेकेंड एग्जाम्पल थर्ड एग्जाम्पल वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस December 2018 for four marks, right? In the network shown figure, the switch is moved from position one to two. Okay, means initially it is connected to the position one. Okay, at t is equal to zero, it is moved from one to two. Okay, determine I of t. Means we need to find the current in this branch. That is nothing but current in the inductor. We need to find. Okay, initially switch is connected to position one, right? When it is connected to the position one. At t is equal to minus infinity. So at t is equal to minus infinity, what is the status of inductor? Before minus infinity, current flowing through the inductor is equal to zero, right? So that's why at minus infinity, inductor will act as an open circuit. At zero minus, the inductor will act as an short circuit, right? At t is equal to zero minus, inductor will act as an short circuit. Switch is connected to position one. Switch is connected to position one. Yes, means here, and this inductor will act as an Zero minus inductor will act as a short circuit, which is connected to position one, right? So this is the equivalent circuit we are having at zero minus, right? So this is the circuit. So what is I of zero minus? It is twenty by five. That is a four ampere. At t is equal to zero, what will happen? Inductor will act as a current source of same as that of I of zero minus, right? So it is a four ampere. So next, what is I of zero? It is a four ampere. Next, for t greater than zero, yes, which is moved to position two. Right, switch is moved to position two. Right, so that's why for t greater than zero, yes, we can draw the equivalent circuit. It is like this. Okay, can we apply KVL to the loop? Yes, it is plus four t minus two i of t minus point five into d i of t by dt is equal to zero. Right, so from this we can find yes, form the differential equation. This is the differential equation. Right, and also we can find the integrating factor. Okay, and we can find the solution. Okay, so what is the solution? I of t Into integrating factor is equal to integration of Q into integrating factor dt plus c. Okay, and further simplifying, and by using the initial condition, we can find the value of c. It is a minus 16. Okay. Next, can we put the value of this c in equation one? Yes. And from this, we can find the expression for the I of t. Right? Means we we need to find the expression for the I of t with the help of by solving the differential equation. Okay. So this type of Questions they have asked in the Solapur University examination. Okay, thank you. Thanks for watching.